Matthew Stuckey here from Verity Baptist Church Philippines, just giving you a quick missionary update. And uh, this past week, we took we counted a total of 153 salvations. Uh, so it was a good week. We had a lot of salvations, and uh, nothing really out of the ordinary happened this past week. No major events. So I'll just give you a quick recap of the sermons that were preached and tell you what's up ahead with our church. But on Tuesdays in Pampanga, we are preaching through uh, the book of First Peter. So we finished First uh, Peter chapter three. The sermon did cut off right at the last two or three minutes. Uh, my phone ran out of battery. And so most of the sermon's up. I'll be uploading that later this week. It's on Facebook. It's not yet on YouTube. Um, in the midweek service, Brother Mateus uh, preached for us in Manila. And he's uh, preaching through John chapter 14, verse 6. And uh, he's got several points he's going to be preaching through the, the next few times he's preaching. And um, on Sunday, I continued the series on how to spot a psychopath. And uh, the first sermon I had preached was an introductory sermon. On Sunday, I preached, started to preach through the 20 characteristics that are listed on the psychopathy checklist. So I went through the interpersonal and affective characteristics, which covers eight different um, traits of what a psychopath is, according to uh, industry, industry standards. I'll try to finish the last 12 um, this coming week, um, assuming that I'm able to get through them. There's a lot of material to cover. Then we're gonna make some applications in that series. And uh, we continued in 1 John chapter 2, and we uh, finished the, la the end of the chapter, and we talked about attributes of false prophets. And that wasn't really meant to uh, coincide with the first sermon, but it just kind of happened to be the way it worked out, because we are going verse by verse through uh, 1 John chapter 2. So not a long missionary update this week. We do have a soul winning marathon coming up in a couple weeks, but uh, things are going well overall. Um, we have struggled with the rain a little bit. It did kind of hinder us during some of our soul winning times. Um, you know, that is kind of predictable this time of year. The unpredictability of the weather is what's predictable. And so sometimes there's a lot of rain and it can hinder soul winning and everything. But God definitely did bless us. We were still able to get a lot of souls saved and uh, do a lot for God this past week. So just continue to pray for our ministry. And uh, thank you for your prayers and support. Thank you and God bless.